Hello, Richard Beach here from Sonic State Amped, and welcome to this feature where we're running a bite sized review of a boss pedal every day for a month. So today we have the Super Octave OC3, a really fun pedal actually, uh, one of the ones I've been looking forward to. So let's get started. I've got a distorted signal on my Egnator Rebel 20, which is going through my Dragoon 2x12 Vintage 30 Celestian Speaker Cab, and I'm playing my Gibson Les Paul 60s Tribute Studio guitar. Here's what my distortion sound sounds like. <laughs> And here is what the super octave sounds like in the mix. I've just got a bit of a sub octave uh, going on here in the mix now, so this is what we've got. So it sounds evil as hell, uh, which is awesome. And what we've got on the real right hand side of the panel from uh, my point of view and your point of view here is a switchable octave mode. So we can have uh, poly octaves going on. We can have a second octave added into the mix or we can have drive, which then changes this knob here. So if I have uh, a drive sound quite high up and I whack the sub octave here on the octave one switch. Even more evil with the drive in there. So obviously we've covered the sort of the craziest sounds. Let's do a clean sound. So I'm going to take the drive down on my amp. So we're going for something much nicer now. So proof that you don't have to be evil uh, to use this particular pedal. And finally, let's go for something, I, I think a really good use of like a poly octave pedal, a super octave pedal, as this is called, is trying to make it sound like an arpeggiated synth. And if I get some more distortion, then that's what I can do. <laughs> Right, so the exact same settings on the pedal with some distortion added on the amp and on my rhythm pickup on the Les Paul. So really sort of uh, thick saw wave synthy sound there. I really like this pedal. I don't really have anything bad to say about it because it, it's not trying to model anything else. It's not, not trying to do anything that it it can't do. So yeah, really great pedal. If you just want something that will make you feel creative, if you're in some sort of like garage rock band, you're just a drummer and a guitarist, great pedal to have in your armory. And uh, I love it and it sounds evil. So I like things that sound evil. Thanks for watching and you can get more guitar news, reviews and videos at sonicstate.com forward slash amped.